This video is now brought to you by GeekRetreat.com Oh, what's up people, Dr. is right here, and welcome to the Pokemon Pack Openings of the Month! Oh yes! Oh yes indeedy! And today, please check out GeekRetreat.com, and today we're starting the Pokemon Tin Battle! Let's get ready to rumble! Yes! The first tins of spring, yes, the new wave of heroes. They, um, Espeon, Sylveon, and Umbreon. We're doing them all in order, and as you guys know, these are the new tins. Now, if you guys are new to the channel, like I said before we do, please subscribe. This is actually strong plastic, I'll have to open it up off camera. Um, please subscribe, but also, if you want to know the rules of the tin battle, it's very straightforward. The promo cards that you get are worth one point. Reverse foil rares are worth zero points. They're not worth anything to me. Hollow rares are worth a point. V cards are worth two points. Or EXs or GXs, whatever you want to see. If they are full arts, they are worth... Um, Three points. If they are Rainbow Rares, alternate artwork card, they're worth four points. But if you get the most expensive card in the set, it is worth a massive five points, as you guys know. So, literally from the get-go, before we go ahead, we'll sleeve up the Espeon. There it is. There's the price for it. And it's one point. So let's see what's in these tins. So we get ourselves Brilliant Star, Brilliant Star, Fusion Strike, Vivid Voltage. Okay, I like these tins. Very, very good, good packs, to be honest. So, we'll start off with, with, with uh, Vivid Voltage. We'll go for Out with the Old, In with the New. Vivid Voltage, what are we hoping for? Of course, the Pikachu cards, or the Amazing Rares. Amazing Rares will be classed as uh, two points, I think. Two, and, no, there's, I say it's about two, three points, I think. I'm not sure. Depends if we pull it or not. Right, so one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Yeah, that's how it is. Yeah. Oh, never mind. Oh, whoops, my mistake. We get ourselves the Zygarde Holo Rare right from the very get go. My mistake. Ah. It's, it's one, two. Um, I've lost my card trick. Oh, I don't remember. One, two, three. In the front. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so we get ourselves a reverse foil and we get ourselves a hollow rare from the very get go. Whoops! <laughs> okay, so right from the very get go, though, Espeon does get himself, gets herself a point, which is good. So we get a Zygarde. Okay, and a normal reverse foil. I need to remember the card trick now. Right, Fusion Strike. Here's your code. And it's gone. One, two, three, I think. And the. Right, so it's one, two, three. Four. Right, okay, so there's the four, there's the rare. I mean there's the energy card. It tells you it's been a long time since I opened up some Pokemon pack openings. It really has been a while. Sligoo. Oh nice! We got ourselves my favourite card of Sun Sword and Shield. We got Cinderace! That is good. That is two points. Wow! Two for two! Espeon is actually doing well for me. My luck is still on my side. I'll take that. Third pack, can we get ourselves a hat trick? Here's your code, and it's gone. One, two, three, four, let's have a look. We got some, wow, that's a beautiful energy card right there. Darkness energy, we got Fruxius, Tro Tropius, another Tropius, that's weird. Riolu, Starly, Milkery, Carablast, Clefairy, Reverse Full Churumbi, and a Flygon Normal Rare, okay. Final pack of Destiny. Espeon's done well. Altogether, it's got four points, which is very, very good to start off with. That's a good start off for the battle, to be honest. Looks like um, Sylveon and Umbreon definitely have their um, their stuff tied up for themselves. Trappings, Piplup, a Reverse Foil Rare Staraptor, and a Heat Ran Normal Rare. Well, we'll sleeve up the normal reverse for our rare myself. There we go. So, before we say goodbye, people, let's see what we pull today. We got ourselves a Cherenby number verse, Sligoo, and Dulva. 
And then for reverse four rare, we got ourselves the Star Raptor. And then for Hollow Rares of the Day, we get ourselves, of course, your promo, which is one point. Espeon. Hollow Rares Zygarde, that's one point. And the Cinderace V, which is two points. If you guys enjoyed it, I surely did. Make sure you stay tuned for the next episode of the Tin Battle. Espeon's got four points. What is Sylveon going to get? Is it going to be four points? Is it going to be less? Or is it going to be beyond imagination with five points or more? Like I said, please check out geekretreat.com. They are amazing. And with that being said, the people I'm going to see you guys for subscribing. And I'll see you guys next time. Cheerio! Not bad, Espeon. Not bad at all. Can the others do better? Let's find out. I like getting these. These are nice. I don't have a clue what the volumes are, but I'm sure they'll pop up right now. Ah! Ah!